Adoration, just tell him thank you. Take your mind back, what you will remember what the Lord has done. Tell him thank you. Tell him thank you. Again and appreciate the King of Kings. Express your gratitude to Him. Tell Him how much you love Him. Tell Him how much you love. Him. He's the soon coming King. He's the reigning King. He's a God who cannot change. Who will never change. Why don't you wave your hands to heaven? Wave your hands to heaven as a sign of honor to Him. Adore Him. Reference Him. Him alone is worthy. Him alone is worthy. Him alone is worthy. A God that does not discriminate. A God that is not biased. A God that is not pleasure. Is the same yesterday, today, and forevermore. In Jesus, mighty name we pray. No, I don't like that amen. I say in Jesus, mighty, mighty name we pray. I'm in the world, Jesus I can not I'm in the world. Oh, I'm in the world, Jesus I can not I'm in the world. Sing it well, sing it well. Verse 1. Psalm 100 verse 1. Make a joyful noise unto the Lord, all ye lands. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Know ye that the Lord is good. He is he that has made us. Not we ourselves. We are his people and the sheep of his pasture. Our God is good. Raise your hands and say, my father, my father, I appreciate you because you are a good God. Open your mouth and thank him because he's a good God. I appreciate God because he's a good God. Good to your children, good to your wife, good to your family, good to everything that you do, good to this church, good to the area conference. I appreciate him for being a good God. He's 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 a good God. Our God is a good God. There is no iniquity in Him. There is no sin in Him. He's a good God. Father, we thank.
thank you because you are a good God. You are a good to the superintendency. You are a good to the area conference. To the superintendency. The way superintendency and the area conference at large. You are a good God. We thank you because you are a good God. In Jesus mighty name we pray. A better amen. A better amen. Psalm 97 verse 5. The hills melted like wax at the presence of the Lord. At the presence of the Lord of the whole earth. Every challenge we've been passing through, the presence of God shall destroy it in the name of Jesus. Whatever you have been going through, the presence of God shall swallow it. Raise your hands up. Say, my father and my father, I am in your presence. I am not going back the same way again. I am going back to um, I am going back restore. I am going back change. Open your mouth and pray prayer. I am going back transform. I am going back restore. I am going back located. My life cannot be the same. I am in the presence of God. And the Bible says the presence of God, there's fullness of God. At the right hand of God, they are blessed forevermore. I'm not going by the same way I came. I'm not going by the same way I came. Oh God, I am in your presence. I am in your presence. I am in your presence. I'm not going by the same way. Look at me. 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 Restore. Restore. Transform my life. Oh God. Say, turn around in my life in the mighty name of jesus christ i bloody with the prayer is going hold somebody hold somebody hold somebody hold your neighbor hold your neighbor look at someone look at someone eyeballs to eyeball don't hold like this don't hold like this first the person one and one we are praying look at him say my neighbor say my neighbor i prophesy to you according to badia one Verse 17, upon Mount Zion, there shall be deliverance, there shall be holiness. The house of Jacob shall possess their possession. In the name of Jesus, I prophesy to your life. What I'm trusting God for, receive it now. Receive it now. Open your mouth and prophesy. 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 Before the conversion is over. Right now, right now, right now, what you have been trusting God for. If you pray well, you have results. If you pray it well, you have results. The wife, the husband, the children, the car, the job, the connection you have been trusting God for. The sound health, have now, receiving now, receiving now, receiving now. In hundred folds, I prophesy, I prophesy to your life, to your destiny, all that you have been believing God for. In the name of Jesus, I speak. You are not going by the same way. 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 Barakarababaras, Rakashatapapaparas. Rapapapaparas Rakalapapaparas In Jesus Mighty name we pray Get many times You are coming up Don't get many times Hold this your hand Say my neighbor, my neighbor. And say strong covenant I can hear your voice. Ancestral covenant. Generational covenant. Speaking against your life. Directly. Or indirectly. Consciously. Unconsciously. Tonight. By the authority. In the name of Jesus. By the power. In the blood of Jesus. I command that covenant. Of your father's house. Of your mother's house, the bread now, bread, 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 bread. Open your mouth and break it. Open your mouth and break it. Covenant of death, covenant of smallness, covenant of poverty, covenant 
for backwardness, covenant of introgression, bread, 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 covenant of good oil, covenant of good oil, covenant of good oil, the fruit of your level. What are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? By thunder, by fire, by thunder, by fire, by thunder, by fire. Let the governor break into that service. Into that service. Ah, Rakasha Dababaras, Rapapaparabaras, Rakarabaras. You pray the more God intervene. The more you pray, the more that covenant is broken. The more you pray, the more you have answers. In Jesus, mighty, mighty name, we pray. Seven people that have it here. I said, It shall go down for your rising. Bible says, In one way they will come, but in seven ways they shall scatter. Somebody says, Scatter, raise your hand. Say, My father, my father, every gang up, every conspiracy, every secret meeting, every plot. Of the enemy against my destiny between now and tomorrow morning, I scatter their plans. I put your mother scatter now, scatter now, scatter now, scatter now, scatter now, scatter now, scatter now. Between now and tomorrow morning, between now and tomorrow morning, their plan is scattered, their plan is scattered. Their plan is scattered. Their plan is scattered. In the name of Jesus Christ. Say Sukti say. Sukti say. Sukti say. Put your two hands on your laps. Look at this scripture. Exodus 19, verse 10 and 11. Media, please, quickly. Exodus 19, 10 and 11. There is something so special about the third day. The third day is not just an ordinary day. Media, please. Exodus chapter 19, verse 10 and 11. And the Lord said to Moses, 
go to the people and consecrate them today the first day consecrate them tomorrow as the following day and let them watch their garments and be ready for me on the third day be ready for me on the third day for on the third day what will happen on the third day what will happen on the third day the lord will come down on mount sinai in the sight of his people the lord will come down but oh jehovah Tell them they should be there the first day. Let them be there on the second day. But on the third day, I will come down. On the third day, I will come down. Oh Lord, as you are coming down today, do not pass my seat. Come on, you wait here, me there. Come on, you here, me there. Then you could not do what you to agar and amurwa. Abasiuko. Then you could not do what. Bonga Camaro. Few seconds. The next few seconds. Then you could not do what you to agar. Kiso 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 kiso. Then you could not do what. And yet, I got a fabu. I'm in more of me. Oh, 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 I declare upon 21 person in this house the next 24 hours your testimony will locate you now. If that event is now done, receive your testimony. Amen. Can you shout a better? Amen. Amen. Clap your hands together for Jesus. Clap your hands together for Jesus. Hallelujah. Three choirs are going to sing today. So quickly. Area Mass Choir will present a cool township superintendency and a weight township superintendency. Before the Area Mass Choir, let's take the two superintendency first, then the Area Mass Choir will join together and then minister. Oku township superintendency first. Oku township superintendency. Oku township superintendency. Are you not ready? All right, it waits. Township superintendency. Which one is ready first? Oku Township superintendency first.
clap better. Hallelujah. In the township superintendency, as the area choir is getting ready. If you have any testimony, I have one testifier here. Please send your names across to us. Give it to any of the ushers. We will give you room to testify.
Can you move on, Jesus Christ? Area mass choir now. Area mass choir. Area mass choir. Thank you, Jesus. Area mass choir. When I'm your boy, no area mass choir. Area me your hunger for young ition. Any mass choir. Me your boy, no mass choir. Boy, I'm funny, so I'm Kingsley. I get ready for their special number. Immediately after this.
Bawidana is where that is. Hallelujah. And then we will get you by Gong Nikan. And then you get a go to you with the idea. And again, if you call me, you know, I see. But we are born of Jesus. Who pass when you call the car? Fear cross stands. I want your chorus. The Academy Conversy. Put an offering in the offering box. Say, God is good. Do you agree with me? God is good. Are we going to get it? I don't say, 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 yeah, you want to pass it Go ahead, sing, and let's give unto the Lord. Spirit, man of your bone for no area mass choir. You have a city of mass choir. I mean, they saw me over no more. Now I waited to make a young ETM more. Me over no more. Me over no the choir director. I conduct the quarter with emotion. Wonderful. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I'm funny, so and case, please come quickly, come quickly, come quickly, come quickly. I don't know whether Reverend Ezekiel Omar and his team is here. I'm funny, so and Kingsley, please come quickly. Where are they? All right.
يا حسين يا حسين تيك فدي كود نوت اولد ان كابتيفز يا حسين يا حسين يا حسين in your body is coming back to life in the name of Jesus whatever you have lost to the restoration in the name of Jesus thank you father for honoring yourself in Jesus name we pray please you may be seated we want to receive the ministry of Reverend Ezekiel Umar Reverend Ezekiel Umar please where is he? Keep clapping, keep clapping. Let's receive his ministry. Next 10 minutes, the next 10 minutes in this convention. Let's welcome the servant of God. Please, let's do it better than that. Clap your hands. I didn't come alone. Where are my backups? Please, I will need the full instrumentation if you are there. Take up the mic, take up the mic. Quickly, please. This is a word. I was here in two occasions, but not in conference. This time around, it's in conference. Can we put our hands together for Jesus? We are going higher and higher and higher. Cry more. Oh my. Bless you. Ah. Can I hear the keyboard sound, please? Jesus said, Yeah, ma. Shout hallelujah! Now we, now we, not important. Jesus and your mind. Come on, be good to go.
song. Any song you hear me sing, they are my songs. So, let me sing the ones. This is my August who will join me as a loser. Igwa is that. Igwa mon bon nam. Akurum kwa maunam fiel ya for this conference. After this conference, you can never go back the same again. I'm in Guarico for 56 years, no result. In Aguaibara, no, no house. But God used one month and pay all. And in this conference, God is going to pay somebody. All the arras. Okay, keep up. I got Vevre. Ma mene reñe min se i bo se Most of you know this song. It was recorded 
and they didn't watch and make a lot of noise in 81 and 82 down till today. The song never died. They me in 2017. They don't build a house for me, buy a car, do everything for me. After many years, oh God, no. Atata, oh God, no. now he's coming back again to sing he's the one to sing and lead us on thanksgiving can we be upstanding as we receive that ministry again that ministry again on thanksgiving yeah. whatever you find yourself doing do it well This is what happened to me 2017. Get Christmas carol night. A quick boy, man. The people shouted, Oh, take him back. Anywhere I go, when I finish singing, they will still shout and say, Take him back. And tonight is not an exemption. They say, I have to go back and do it better. Are you ready to go with me? Let me ask you, sir, sir, what do you have me do? What do you want me to do? Sing down the Holy Ghost. Hear me. Holy Ghost, where are you? You need to come down. You are still sitting down. 
Don't wait for me. Mambo mbrebe na kama de sing down the Holy Ghost. Are you not hearing? Hey. Jesus said, "Ye ma." That song, maybe the ones Makosa. Oh, I played. <laughs> sure. Sure. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. Raise your two hands. Please lead. We are giving offerings now. It's time for offerings. Please move. As Offering. the song goes on, we offer unto the Lord. Please let's move. Wow. I have a win. I have a win in the Lord. I have a winner. I am a winner. Oh, 
together for Jesus. I put over one look at Mr. Can I can and bong a yummy redeem book can come forward and drop your a can of a can ama. Now it's here to pay convention program for Kenya. He said, now so it's here to pay. Now so it's here to pay. Ben is a camera funny them for good. No one fan of funny them all. Go ya from for your one fan. Funny them big bong, but when they come for them for, go ya from for you some more. But when they come in on for you, they make them come back. Sang a di di ano. I go to the program in Sang a kawa. Area che manabo ya kawa ke pick hundred naira bong. Just kawa ke pick it hundred naira. Kawa ke pick it hundred naira. Fega kake na mirado, fega kama ke pick it, hundred naira ba sudi yonaka asien, 
Say, I can make shock a mania program. I mean, for my name, I can't bong Sangadi, the noy can't do Sangadi, the sue can't am for Sangadi, the sue can't am for Sangadi, the sue can't am for. I said, Young man, take a can, I can, and you must see a can. Sangadi, see a can, I'm for Sangadi, see a good to your care account number. I display care. We can be copy, don't I'm transformed for. Sangadi, see a can, I'm for. Only a program, I make a work a bin cape. I had your conventional medical and a full near and for me go for him for. He did your model bar. Sangadi, see a can, I'm for. I said, Young Monsekan, I make a young Monsieur Gana. Monsem mix come again for us, and no more came here. She can't bong. I see the young buffo. I see the young buffo. But some are the sober subject, but you can't bong when it's a convention anthem in your presence. I am content. Can we please be upstanding? As the keyboard is given us the tune quickly. Well, at the team. As they were in the upper room waiting for his presence and the Bible says the Spirit of the Lord came upon them ask the Lord of God I am here in your presence do not pass me by tonight open your mouth and pray that prayer as I am waiting on you do not pass me by. As you are passing through this way, the next reasonable minute, let your word come alive in me. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father.
We are waiting on you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. In the name of Jesus Christ. Ask your neighbor, are you ready tonight? Ask someone, are you ready tonight? If you know you are ready, can you clap those hands as we receive God's servant, Reverend O.T. Benson, as he's bringing God's word to us tonight. God's servant, you are welcome, sir. Keep clapping those hands as we receive our Father. Hallelujah. Keep clapping those hands. Thank you. Hallelujah. Church, hallelujah. I don't even want to bother myself by asking somebody if there is anybody that is happy in the house. I've already seen joy in your house. Can you shout hallelujah? hallelujah. I'd like to appreciate God in the first place for the beautiful and wonderful moments of this very kind he has given unto us to come together from the first day of this conference meeting And I know the one that has started this good work in this program shall take it to perfection in the name of Jesus. I remain here so humbled to respectfully appreciate the presence of the area conference chairman. Reverend Dr. Inyabongdo for affording me of a privilege of this kind to say something in this convention. Nongbenu Fangamedikom, the chairman and the members of the planning committee. Not because I am the best, but because the Lord decided at least to make use of me for a while in the life of this convention. I really appreciate God for the wisdom, the grace that God has endowed upon every member of this planning committee to come up with a program that is taking this shape and the color that the program carries. I equally appreciate the members of the stand the members of the area standing committee, also the elders, deacons and deaconesses, chairman of the booth, superintendencies, choir groups from Kwaibu Church, superintendency and a wet, township superintendency as well, the children, men and women. I'm asking God to bless us all. Can I hear louder? Amen. Amen. Today, on the first day of this program, when the area chairman came up to make an exposition of this topic, I listened carefully when he told us the six dimensions of the Holy Spirit. And today, by God's special grace, 
I don't think my, prof my presentation is going to prove more excitement. But what I'm going to present by God's special grace is going to be a kind of presentation that will create an atmosphere of sober reflection and decision making in the life of this meeting. And because of that, I am going to flow by God's special grace in a different dimension. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, in the presence of my God, I will bring my gift with dancing in the end of There is joy in my heart Flowing like a river I will praise my God Oh, with dancing Can I hear you sing with me? Hey. They go coming in please let the person do it with a very respectable manner please I need a relaxed atmosphere thank you on the first day 
a great servant of God, led us on the topic dimensions of God's presence. And he said a lot of good things, which I'm here to appreciate him for a wonderful and holistic exposition of the thing. Yesterday night, another great man of God came talking about the power of the power. The what? The power of the king's presence. Today, because the area chairman lies with me, I'm going to make it very brief because Sunday, while these two men were preaching, some of them, almost half of what I had in mind to share with you, they spoke on them and I said, wow, what am I going to preach? The first day. And the second day, almost all the seven points were all cleared by this man. And I said, God, what am I going to say? Throughout the night, I did not sleep. I said, God, what do you want me to speak to the people? And I prayed and the Lord led me to speak on the topic. The mystery of God's presence. The mystery of God's presence. When we are talking about mystery, we are talking about a condition. Something that is very hard. Something that is very difficult to grasp. With human understanding. So why I'm saying that I'm going to take or flow in a different dimension. It's all about, we have been praying, the man, the man of God has taken time exposing the competencies of God's presence, the length that God's presence can go, what God's presence can accomplish unto us in various and in all ramifications of our lives, affecting our physical life, also affecting our spiritual life, everything about us. And we were praying. Good prayer points. Let me equally appreciate moderators and prayer coordinators leaders who came up and lead, it, or lead us in inspiring prayer points. And I believe that gave us Yukubu Frefre a Kamaru. But one thing, let us not focus on the presence of the Lord outside. I want to bring it home. That is why I want to talk about the mystery of God's presence. And let us take our Bible reading. We read from Exodus chapter 33. Exodus chapter 33. We want to read it together. Exodus chapter 33 from verse 1 to 3. Look up. Uh, Please can we read it all together? Genesis, Exodus chapter 33, verse 1. Can we read it? One, two, go. Let me have it now, media people. Verse But I will not go with you. We are coming back to that. But I will not go with you. Now read it down. And I will not go with you. This is the nation. This is the people that the Lord killed King Pharaoh. Destroy all the mysteries of Egypt. A whole president, Egyptian president. But because the Lord decided to disgrace him that way. Because he tempered with the nation that the Lord has chosen unto himself. You don't know who you are. 
And so he made so many promises unto them. I will bless you. I will drive out all these hostile nations before you. And finally, I will give you rest. And let me tell you the background of that text. When you read Exodus chapter 32, you will discover that when the people of Israel, the Lord brought them out of Egypt, these people encamped in Sinan of sin, say, uh, wilderness of sin. They were there. And the Lord said to Moses, Moses, come up the mountain. Moses went up the mountain and spent some days with the Lord on the mountain. And the people of Israel said to Aaron, Aaron, are you sure that your brother Moses is alive? We seem to be confused. We seem to be stranded in our journey. Let us make another God who will lead us back, not going forward. And that is what exactly a lot of people are doing. In your Christian race, when you come in contact with difficulties, you decided to retreat. You decided to quit. You decided to give up. And Aaron, because of the pressure sent to Egypt, Israel while Moses was up the mountain, the Lord spoke to Moses, Moses, go down and see what is happening among the people. When Moses came down the mountain, he saw the people of Israel. Moses said, After a while, the anger of the Lord subsided. The Lord called Moses again and said, Moses, and that is the condition in chapter 33. Moses, these people have stayed in this place and they have continually provoked me into anger. Tell them to leave this place. Moses, this is what I'm going to do. Imagine how we operate the church with the pastor. The presence of the Lord is not there. Think about I want everybody to relax. I'm not going to preach to provoke incitement, excitement. Imagine the women's fellowship. Imagine the prayer band. Imagine the choir group in the church that is operating today. The leader is there leading. The choir master is there leading. But the presence of the Lord is not going, is not there. Imagine how that church will be when we are talking about the presence of God. Let us bring it home. Church, hallelujah. And that leads to the request of Moses. Moses said to the Lord, so you will not go with us. Bros, let me tell you, so you will not go with us. Remember that I was on my own business. So it was you that called me. I will go good. Now you want to frustrate them. That was not their plan. That was the condition that Moses requested of the Lord. If your presence does not go with us, we will never go. Now let me tell you two things in the statement of Moses. Number one, Moses simply means that staying in this wilderness in desert with the presence of God is far better than going to the, pre the promised land without the presence of God. That is exactly. Some of us, we believe in material things. You do this to get money, you don't value the presence of the Lord. Staying in wilderness with the presence of God. Church, hallelujah. Just relax, just relax. I want you to see logic right there. Hallelujah. You take pleasure. What you really concern, you say, dear. Say, Sine, you want to be sunshine, Baba. You want to be sunshine, woman. Whatever it takes, you go on that. But you don't think about the presence of the Lord going with you. Is the presence of the Lord going with you? 
Igerezeria. Moses said, "Okay, ni my petia gadeza. My brother, let me tell you the truth. If the presence of the Lord go with you, I'm not talking about the presence of God in generality, but now I am trying to personalize it. When the presence of God is with you, even though you are sleeping carry today, it is well with you than for you to eat and be fat when the presence of the Lord is not there. Because you are alone. Church, the Lord said to Moses, what a pathetic situation that can happen to the church. I'm talking to Kwaibo Church away. Kwaibo Church Oku. And every other congregation. It is better to stay in that particular place of desert with the presence of the Lord than going into the land of Canaan with the presence of God. Amen. Amen. Is somebody listening? Yes. That is number one thing. The most important thing is the presence of God. When we have succeeded in possessing God's presence, we have gotten everything. What do you talk about? What do you talk about? Hallelujah. ministry. You have gotten everything in the ministry. You have gotten everything. The presence of God we are talking about. So when we are talking about everybody, Moses some of us we are living a very kind of corrupted kind of life that is carrying away the presence of the Lord with you corrupted is some Christian if you look at the way including myself the way we are living our lives is my lifestyle such a one that is conducting the presence of the Lord with me sister Church, hallelujah. Number two. Moses, by requesting from the Lord in Exodus chapter 33, the house, verse number 14, verse number 15, he said that Moses said to him, If your presence does not go with us, we will never move from this place. It's soon for me, but I'm because protection because there is no guarantee for safe arrival then your presence must go with us beloved of god when we are talking about the presence of god the only thing that will make difference in our lives where we are working when our enemies shall rise against us is for every individual christian the church as a congregation to make sure that the church is operating under the leadership of the presence of god we are wasting our time. It is the presence of the Lord that will lead the church. The presence of God that is leading choir. It is not only when you come to church before you feel like come back. You can possess the presence of God personally. The presence of the Lord can be there with you in your home. When you are going into office, in the business transaction, I want every member of this area conference, including myself that is talking, that let us live a kind of life that will conduct, that will attract God's presence in our personal life. Some of us, let me tell us, in the presence of the Lord we sing. In the presence of the king let me tell you the presence of the lord is everywhere but if the presence of the lord is operating in this church the presence of the lord does not affect everybody it is do say
Afomadu wam ni de yina basi emi iso basi abi nam so mbo ari kan mefo Amen When you are able to possess God's presence you have gotten everything What really makes Jacob to be a successful man Because even though he ran away from his parents what made him a great man a prosperous man because the presence of the lord was with him irrespective of where you find yourself a lot of people are backing out from abuja and one girl from where in back abuja couldn't get him but mark abuja and who tells you do you know how many people that are parking from abuja every day do you know people that are parking out of lagos every day it doesn't matter where you find yourself what really matters in your life is when you possess the presence of god in Genesis 26, the Lord said to Abraham, to Isaac, so sit. And Bible made us to understand that Isaac had done parts of his song. Then in your dog, moon one, who told me, Kaki, Nisiki, Amadu, could you so much and Amazon Bob? About that, don't make this over me. You don't come to Mukan to Mudun to Parawa, Bangutonko. Do women me so much and Amazon Bob? The worst condition you can face in this life is for you to live your life and in the presence of the Lord is not with you. Go even come back, you will come back to square one. That is exactly. Church, am I saying the truth? Yes, sir. Can you tell God thank you? Yes, Raise up your hand and tell God thank you. In your job, Abika. In your job, Asiama, Kamenyan. In the one to go to Lagos. You know, for one more. The presence of the Lord shall cause even the sad land that you find yourself, irrespective of the family background that you are coming from. May we be, eh, who for all the ways you want to come back? I didn't am dumb dumb. Who born the? Who born the? Who can stop you from coming to manifestation? When the presence of the Lord is with you, the man of God spoke at length yesterday, and it thrills my spirit. I was so happy from the first day of this meeting. I added to the little that I knew already about the importance of the presence of God. Praise the Lord. That will never solve the problems. When you have the presence of God with you, when you kneel down where you are, the Lord of heaven will answer you. Church, my message, I'm not going far. I don't really want to go far. Even the remaining part, I'm going to pause there. Because I listen to my spirit when he tells me, to run on I can prepare. Area conference for us to be successful. Yaridu we do well. Pastors, there is no two way. When I see people struggling in the ministry, then I love at them. I charge every one of you. What you needed in the ministry is not the great one church. Church, hallelujah. It is not the great one church. It is not the window church. A man with God's presence sent to the forest to preach to save with the lord the lord shall transform the forest into township it doesn't matter when you have this fact and this truth you become a free man it doesn't take much to succeed it doesn't make take much to become a gentleman now to become a gentleman is not a big deal when you have navy blue suit and white tie and black shoes you become a, a gentleman so somebody will say good morning so i say go good morning good morning yeah, go. it doesn't take much hallelujah it doesn't take much to succeed to go even and eat coming down the mountain to valley the dobasi kwaibo church with your metropolitan area conference what is necessary in the process of appropriation in all the congregation is for laws for us to live a kind of life that will conduct Number one, the presence of God into your personal life. You need not to go to a mountain before you see the presence of God. The presence of God is everywhere. You want to be talk of time, a guy, a this and a this. Because of all this kind of life, the presence of the Lord is running a, a well. Let us not, I will talk about one of the mysteries 
of the presence of God. That is one of the things. Church, hallelujah. Can you celebrate the Lord as you lift up your hand? only have the perception the concept the idea of seeing the presence of the lord as a weapon of war against our enemies because number two i want to let you know one of the mysteries of the presence of god is that the presence of god is very very dangerous number one i'll show you examples dangerous don't mess with the presence of god number one in the book of second samuel chapter 6 verse number 16 from verse 6 to 7 second samuel chapter 6 verse 6 to 7 when the people of israel went out for war uh -huh. when they came can we read all together one to go uh, you know what you're afraid please, please 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 go back let's read it all together one to go Verse 7. The acts of the Lord was a symbol of God's presence. I'm talking about God's presence is very, very dangerous. Let us not see the pleasurable, the beautiful aspect of the presence of the Lord. We are talking about, Sir was talking about dimension constructive dimensions of the presence of God and destructive destructive dimension of God's power so when we come to church we need to be very careful the act of covenant again represents the presence of God among his people again when I'm doing to Israel again you Jehovah I go over the source of power and on the to Israel because the instruction was that that signified the presence of the Lord. But let the presence of the Lord is very, very dangerous. Be careful of the things you do. In the presence of the Lord. In the name of the Lord, the man who is for the one, I for the one against the rule of God. Know that the presence of God is very, very dangerous. We send Gary Yana. I'm going to talk about one thing. Do you believe that? So when we come to the presence of the Lord, that the man of God spoke last night. I want to meet the Gary of the book of the Sea Yara. In on Yen, give him pause here. We get away. For a campaign, no, no. Now, it is what is happening in the church is a dangerous combination. A dangerous combination. You combine Amok with Christianity, you combine a Kanka with Christianity. A dangerous combination. The Lord is watching. Know that the presence of the Lord is very, very dangerous. Church, hallelujah. Can you say, Lord, speak to us? Or it is your Sam in Bill of Fire. Digibo. Some member will receive. I told you that I'm going to take a different dimension. And I said from the beginning that my presentation is going to spur up excitement. It's going to create an atmosphere of reflection. You think about it. The presence of the Lord is very, very dangerous. When you come to church, where we believe that that is where, even though the presence of the Lord is everywhere, but we think that Okay, when we come to this place, we have the presence of the Lord in this place. Be careful of the things that you do. Hallelujah. It's very, very dangerous. Another person, Acts of the Apostle chapter 5. I'm trying to show you the perils of God's presence. Ananias came and Savera lying in the presence of God and both of them 
died. I'm telling you the celebrity of God's presence. Know how you relate with the presence of God. I remember a time. By that time, I was a guy. Guy. I was a member of the choir. So, in the choir group, let me confess my sin. If you don't allow me, I will keep quiet too. So, there was a very beautiful girl. That day was t- Tuesday. I have a letter in my pocket. In your single when no can I love you than my mother. I love you. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm standing before the Lord to say this. During that choir practice, that girl did not come. And that day was a day. After choir practice, we joined prayer group where prayer conference will start. So instant later, I one day you're going to see. When people were praying fervently, I'm not talking about show. I'm talking about the committee. When I look at what is happening today in the world, I'm not judging anybody. God is a speaking a talking God. I came in the Kada. I mean, I'm buying the Kada Kada. Don't get him I mean, I'm telling you nothing but the gospel. I'm telling you the presence of God. The presence of God. where I love you than my mother. I mean, the Togogoro. I the leader prayer band. Ben where the name so Paul fuck. And you know what? Ben you could say minka what? I mean, to Afro we no make ham. I'm not sure what you do here. You know what? And the Lord spoke to me. He said, I have a good will for you. Don't frustrate your future. Because I have a good plan for you. The Lord exposed me in his presence. Let me, let me warn you. Let me warn you. Let us not toll with the presence of God. Let us not toll with the presence of the Lord. Let us not toll with the presence of the Lord. Let us not toll with the presence of the Lord. Let us not toll with the presence of the Lord. Let us not toll with the presence of the Lord. Let us not toll with the presence of the Lord. Let us not toll with the presence of the Lord. Let us not toll with the presence of the Lord. Let us not toll with the presence of the Lord. Let us not toll with the presence of the Lord. Let us not toll with the presence of the Lord. Let us not If at all we want the presence of the Lord to go with us, from that day, who sent prophets here to tell me, go on, I'm going and expose me and kill you. Nowadays, prophecy nowadays don't expose sin. I won't walk forward, I won't walk forward, I won't walk forward, I I mean, my young and my mom went one and only wouldn't fall. I would own your mother, God, don't kid young. The presence of God, I'm talking about the perils of the presence of God. When you come, Ecclesiastes chapter 5 said, Be careful when you you are stepping in before Karaku for Abbasi. Abbasi say, Yara woo, you know, they do Nam do, who send Kerayabo Yasum by no one came Finally, my area chairman. The presence of the Lord must be respected. As the presence of God can turn against the very person. In the book of Joshua chapter 7, when the people of Israel went for war against the city of Ai, a very few population of people. And whenever 
Because I can never have been born so I did not go to a more. It's so much you want to go to Israel. I can't get a young girl. I'm a leg. I'm a leg. I can't get to Israel. Drab a series of two meters. Oh, and you can do for me. So I'm born that kingdom. No fee for good to know. It's so maybe in Amazon. Oh, it's a guy. No for who won't walk off. I want to come get the presence of the Lord is not there. Forget about this if you yourself, you pray and you begin to speak in tongues, you are wasting your time. Forget about jumping and shouting. The presence of the Lord will not go. Since that what you needed is life, it's not uncle to succeed. What you needed is the presence of God. When the presence of God is with you, forget about. He will become everything unto you. Church, hallelujah. Sometimes the presence of the Lord can fight against the people of God when we are living in sin. The presence of the Lord can fight against the church, can fight against the pastor as myself, can fight against the members, even the prayer bar. But when we are talking about the presence of God, let us not see it in terms of that is one of the mysteries of the presence of God. Hallelujah. Finally, let me just summarize by saying this. The privilege of God's presence is that we might have fellowship with the invisible God so that we must be distinct from other people. My yesterday and my today. If your yesterday does not make difference of today, we are still in problem. The presence of God. So as we are coming together, the presence of the Lord will come and wash us. So that we grow in grace to become more like Christ Jesus. That is the essence of the presence of the Lord. God does not only use his presence, uses his presence to attack our enemies. It is a privilege that God has given unto us. Remember, and the Lord said to Moses, Bene more than God. See, no, if we war, you are not war. I put on me, you have a mood of me, and I'm some bow. Maybe. You cry too much for wishes and witchcraft. You too much accuse your uncle, my grandma, and my check yourself. When you have the presence of God, when you possess the presence of God, the deed of the wicked grandma, you still manifest in that place. What matters is not the wicked people around you. What really matters is how you possess, you attract the presence of the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I know the Lord will make a way. I know 